Hey guys, Scarrow9 here. Welcome back to my channel today. And this is going to be my third out of all five of the planetary guides on the quickest way to farm the emblem variants for the five different patrol zones within Destiny 2. In this video, we're going to be going over the patrol zone on Nessus and specifically going over the best and most efficient route you can run to farm these four emblem variants. So if you guys are not aware, these emblem variants actually come from the random chests that can spawn around a patrol zone. However, there are also rumors of them dropping from public events and from high value targets chest as well. I have not had any of those yet occur out of the 12 that I have. However, keep that in mind when you are farming. Now to do this farm, you're going to want three main things. Once again, you're going to want the Mida multi-tool to make you run faster. And you are also going to want your speed exotic based on your class. So the stompies for the hunters, the transverse steps for the warlocks and the dune marchers for the Titan. And then finally, you're going to want a ghost shell that tracks chests on Nessus. So this route is actually going to be on the watcher's grave location within the Nessus patrol zone. It's on the very very top of the map and essentially when you spawn in you're going to run a giant circle around the outside of the map. This one's pretty straightforward. About three to four chests spawn every single time so it does go fairly quickly. This was actually the quickest farm out of any of them for me personally. I got all of mine in about three hours which is about half the time that I spent getting the EDZ variants. So you can be pretty mindless with this farm. Whenever you run around the ghost will actually pretty much pick up any chest that you are around. Essentially just make sure you follow the exact path that I am taking because I hit the most potential chest spawns and the only thing I really would pay attention to is when you are jumping down into the watcher's grave over to the right there are a couple of areas that chests can spawn so if you just quickly glance over there and see if there's any that spawn there you'll save yourself a lot of time so you run around the outside of the circle you'll jump up on the edge complete the circle then you will fly back to the watcher's grave area and start again until you get all of them so I hope you guys did enjoy this video if you did make sure to leave a like rating and to share it with your friends if you were interested in watching either of the two videos on screen you can click their respective annotations to be taken to them if you're brand new to my channel make sure to hit the giant version of my logo on screen to be subscribed from our awesome destiny 2 videos and live streams thank you guys so much for watching today and i will see you in my next video